Now in Lebanon, at least two dozen people, including ten soldiers, have been injured during demonstrations in Tripoli. Protesters clash with the army that has been deployed to quell the unrest over the worsening socio-economic conditions. The army said five of the soldiers were wounded in a hand grenade attack. Meanwhile, the international community continues to call for progress in the country's stalled political process. France, the European Union and the United States have urged Lebanese politicians to form a new government as a matter of urgency. An international conference is also being planned to support the efforts. Earlier Prime Minister-designate Saad Hariri stepped down over disagreements with the President on the Cabinet.